Be on your guard. You can never be too prepared. But did we have to spend so much? Everything will be okay now. I know the basics of healing arts, but my skills pale in comparison. we'd find answers on Lenigus, but we just ended up finding more questions. You can say that again. And now we have more problems to fix, too. Like figuring out how to reform Lenigus. That can wait for now. Yeah. All the answers we've been... The answers... So, what do we do? We know nothing about the Renan... It's also entirely... If we come across... <laughs>
Damn! The hell just happened? Our course has been altered. The coordinates are pointing to a different destination. What's that? The ship's controls aren't accepting my commands. The engine is being shut down. That's bad, right? Quite bad. We've lost control of the ship. Is all of this the Red Women's doing? Are they trying to finish us off before we can land? <laughs> Everyone! Look there! Flower blooming out of Retta? But that flower looks like it's absorbing all of Dennis' energy. And it appears Lenigus is serving as a conduit for that energy to reach here. Could that have been its true purpose all along? If that's true, do you think the people back on Lenigus are all right? <sighs> we can only pray that they are. Damn it! Haven't they taken enough already? When is this going to end? The Flower of Oblivion. With everything that's happening, we need to get back to Lenigus. Is the ship still offline? Unfortunately, yes. Even more so than when it laid dormant. Can you fix it? Starships are extremely complex machines. One wrong move while we're out here in space could very well cost us our lives. So what? We're just stuck inside here, floating around? For how long? <sighs> I don't believe this. We've made it all this way, and now we're stuck here? We're watching Dana die before our eyes, and we have no choice but to sit here and starve to death? Law, calm down! You're not the only one who's worried here. Right. Sorry. It's still too early to give up. There has to be a way to get out of this. Alfin. Ah! Now what? The starship, it... it's back online? No, this is different. Something is pulling our ship in towards it. We managed to get moving, but where are we? It looks like Lenigus in here. Do you think we might run into more Renans here? Or those Red Women? Perhaps. 
Someone brought us here. The question is, who? We haven't been ambushed, so that probably means they aren't hostile. Still, why would anyone want to bring us here? Uh, hey, Shion! If they wanted to attack us, they could have done so while we were back on the Star. I still can't get over what we saw happen. Yeah. I've only ever seen... Still, though, beats me. Rena and Dana. But to think that they lie... Dohalim. Okay, who's the wise guy that summoned us here? Someone formidable enough to bring our starship along with us. They must be here somewhere. This place looks a lot like that room we saw back in the Forbidden Zone. Huh? What's that? Ah, it's one of those! A red woman in disguise. Or is this their true form? So it was a trap? It doesn't look like it can move. Tell me, are you the one who brought us here? That is correct. It is unusual for me to have unexpected guests these days. It can talk. What are you? Hevrecht 35. Hevrecht 35? Is that your name? Correct. What is this place? No, wait, before that, just what exactly are you? Are you somehow associated with the Red Women? Before I answer, I have a question for you. How did you all arrive in this sector? We did not come to this place by choice. Our ship was brought here against our will, by a group of red women who can shift into the same form as you. In that case, we can assume my brethren who serve the Great Spirit have deemed you all to be a threat most grave. What do you mean, serve? Are you saying there really is someone more powerful than the red women, pulling their strings? What did you do to us? I examined your bodies. You have not been harmed in any way. Identifiers detected. The Sovereign and Maiden are among you. However, you aren't under its control. I see why they viewed you as a danger now. Oh goody, more riddles. Do you think we can trust this thing? Like it or not, I shall now answer your questions. We are Helganquil. The red women you encountered previously are a form of disguise we employ from time to time, but not our true form. Helganquil? You are on Dake Faisal, a celestial base which drifted here by accident. The will of Rena's great spirit no longer reaches us here. Since my sudden separation from the Great Spirit's influence, I have used any and all means to extend my lifespan. As I have done so, I have also set out to monitor and research Rena and Dana from this position. A question. What is this Great Spirit of which you speak? Is it something that rules over your kind? Correct. The Great Astral Spirit is a large mass of astral energy that fills all of Rena, one with its own will, a voice we cannot refuse. A voice? Just like Dana. 
The voice of the Great Spirit speaks to our hearts directly, and we have served it without question throughout the ages. Does that mean it was controlling your minds? Wait a second. Could this Great Spirit be the true sovereign of Rena? The true ruler of Rena? It could be the same thing that's controlling Volron. Wait, back up. You're telling us this great spirit of yours is the one that ordered you things to harvest the astral energy from Dana? I'm not sure I believe that. Why not? We've already made contact with the will of Dana back in the Wedge, and in the Forbidden Zone on Lenigus. Maybe not, but think about what you're saying. If Dana has a will like Rena, then that would mean that we've been controlled by the voice of Dana this whole time, just like these things. Dana's will hasn't been forcing us to do anything. Yeah, but... Let's assume that what Hevrek 35 claims is true, and that we are indeed cut off from both planets. Even if we had previously been under the control of Dana's will, we would have noticed now that we are disconnected. Your fear is not based in logic. The voice of Dana is much smaller and quieter compared to that of Rena's great spirit. Rena's astral energy is amassed at its center, whereas Dana's is shared among all its constituents. So thinly is that energy spread that it cannot coalesce and formulate a will. Our findings here indicate as much. Which explains why we felt its will where we did. The Wedge and Lenigus are where so much of that energy had been accumulated. The Great Spirit's desire is to consume all astral energy, and the pursuit of that desire is why you see Rena in its current state. As a result, it has turned its attention toward Dana. Is that why the Crown Contest is necessary? Indeed. Had the initial spirit channeling from 300 years ago succeeded, all of Dana's astral energy would have been seized. But the ceremony failed. Lenigus was severely damaged, and you lost both the Sovereign and the Renesalma. Correct. A change in plan was required to ensure the spirit channeling success. However, recreating the Renesalma required a vast amount of energy. That is why we turn to Dana. So that was the real purpose behind the Crown Contest. This is all happening because of me. Nevertheless, you still haven't answered one of Alfin's original questions. Just why have you brought us here to your base, Hevrecht 35? First, it was to confirm the identities of you, my unexpected visitors. Second, it was to ascertain whether you would be likely to accept my request. A request? But what could someone like you want us to... I wish for you all to slay the Great Spirit. I'm sorry, did you just ask us to kill your master? I did. It is in your best interest that you do so, I might add. What makes you say that? Lenigus has entered the final stage of the spirit channeling plan. As we speak, Dana's energy is being harvested en masse and transmitted to Rena. If nothing is done about the Great Spirit, it will not be long before all is lost. You're saying the destruction we saw earlier is just the beginning? We won't let that Why do you want us to kill the Great Spirit so badly? No. My primary concern is validating our findings and analysis. As such, it is my desire to see how your actions impact and change these systems. Vengeance? For what? In spite of our long service to the Great Spirit, our species is on the brink of extinction. You mean... you're dying? At this stage, it would be wise for you to talk with the others. Ask them what you need to know. Others? I am the only Helganquil who inhabits Dake Faisal. Hey! Hey! It's no use. I think it's done talking to us. You can't seriously... To be honest, the... At the very least, that being said... The spirit of... But 
Why? It doesn't matter. Right. There is how the Great Spirit, the Helganquil, and the Crown Contest. Oh, now that you mention it, and all that talk, Hevrek 35 never even brought up the Renans once. Maybe it had a reason for keeping it silence. Let's find it. Who are they? Hmm... W what is it? Oh, my apologies. It's just been so long since I've seen any humans from the outside world. Are you a Renan? Hmm? Oh, yeah, I guess so. Hmm? The Overseer told us to answer any questions you might have, but be quick. What a weird guy. He must have meant Hevrecht 35. And what was that about subjects? There isn't anyone else we can taunt here. Have you guys lived up here? Yes. I, we regularly go into stasis. Why are you all even here in the first place? Originally, this station was where we worked to perform maintenance on Lenegas from the outside. We heard that the facility ended up in its current location due to an accident. Oh, it was terrible. Apparently, there was some kind of accident. And you've been working for Hevrecht 35 ever since? Well, at first we thought... What do you mean? The Helgan Quill has... As long as they don't do anything obvious, a Renan won't see one, even if it's right in front of them. Which would explain why Shion and I failed to notice the Red Women previously. I haven't been able to scientifically confirm it for myself, but from what I understand, the type of cloaking they use is primarily achieved through mechanical means. In addition, they also used hypnosis devices and information control. It's a pretty sophisticated operation. As I have to imagine that's how Lenegas is still run. But aren't the Helganquil themselves controlled by the Great Spirit? The Great Spirit's mind control only works on Helganquil. You act like this didn't affect you personally. I mean, sure. Hevrek 35 has clearly ceased concealing itself, though. Who can say? Don't you want to go back home to Rena or Lenegas? No way. After all this time, there's nothing to be gained from going back. Things are going just fine. Not that it'll be that said. Thank you, friend. Can we talk to you? Sure. It's going to be a while before the- Please, tell us- You mean the over- Well, for start- <laughs> Where else? From Rena, obviously. From Rena? Of course not. There's really no such thing as Renans in the first place. Excuse me? Oh, I thought the Overseer explained everything. Apparently not. Please, tell us more. Well, in a nutshell, the Renans were originally created from Danans by the Helganquil. <laughs> But if that's true... There aren't. But there are Helganquil. But what need could they possibly have to create a whole new race of people? It was a way to bolster their dwindling workforce. In essence, they gathered Dan in... That's why we... Let me get this straight. Oh, you... Wait! Helganquil technology is truly amazing. They have these tiny machines that are practically invisible, which they insert into their bodies and... Enough! How can you speak so calmly about all of this? I guess I can see how and... But if you ask me, I... If it meant their hand... Anyway, the Helganquil... They're also mostly the ones behind what you... I see. Does he really expect us to believe that Renan's never truly existed? How absurd. Dohalim. Just when I think we're getting... And let's hope this for a while. Do you know anything about... If you mean the first plan... Yes. Exactly. However, the second, we had to... I take it the solutions to the... We have a winner! <sighs> the reason for... <sighs> for the next plan, we tried to recreate the Renis Alma. To amend that, we set our... And the crown... Correct. Since the Maiden had been the failing point in the previous... A new sovereign... It was such tremendously difficult... So that's what the purpose of that... What about the flower? Flower? Oh, that thing. As I'm sure you've noticed, it's... Hevrecht 35. It is. Are we done... He talks like the... You've got to remember... 
feels like our whole- Seriously, I'm- Let's take a moment. I know all of this is a lot to believe and take in. Agreed. Everything that- And to get then. Plus, <laughs> either way, why don't we- That's a good idea. If the rent- Because it- So let- I'm sure you- I could have- I figured out- I'll go on. Sounds good. Everyone's just gone their own way, huh? Yeah, let's hit up each- That turned out good, if I did- It's you two. He who? I know that we're all struggling to- What do you think about- On some level, I'm not even- But if that thing's held as for the rest- How so? Coexistent, in my case, so. <laughs> you kept- You mean about the Renans? But I know you're already aware- And even just among the- I think if we can- Well, for- Yeah. It's no small task. Right. Every- In a worst case scenario- And we all have to- That's an inter- It's true. It won't be, but I think, and now? How are you holding up, Rinwell? Yeah. I get this. But I was thinking, if <laughs> Danon's probably won't be so quick. It wouldn't surprise me. Yeah. But even so, so I was thinking. Rinwell. That great Danis will. Now that you mention it, ever. Maybe. We won't. You're not the only- Really? Did you forget what happened back in- th It was re- Yeah, what? Man, Law, I was too worried about that w But all this talk about- I know this is going to sound st- Oh? I used to worry all the time, and when I realized my- But that's when I fu- In other words, the thing that's all I wanted- Not every- Huh? It's some- Law, forget- Yeah, <laughs> I'll fight- I have... You mean here? Indeed. Even... Let's not... <laughs> I cannot... That's just... Uh, to say the... When you say... Correct. Putting us... So... And at the same time, there is... And the victim... I didn't ex... Men and see... There had been... But things can... Indeed. On that... Oh? I wish for you to serve as a mediator, so that the Renans can live on Dana peaceably. As the one and only blazing sword. And I... T yes. However, the fact... <laughs> is it... No. Relax. <clears throat> They're too kind. That's some. Then I'll. You don't even. Thank you. Well, it's. What about you, Xion? To be honest, I'm. I'm not really all that shocked, actually. Right now. How do you mean? Because for a really, really long. I thought I'd. I would have never. It's been going. It was Nate. How it felt. I don't think Naori. She considered me. I don't. Uh, huh? When we were talking to Kisara earlier. About all that stuff, like everyone's needing to meet halfway, and she said that the first that means for forget. Yeah, if we have any, you know, it's not, but if we can, I'm there, I think. Yeah, well, there's yes. I well, is everybody ready to? I am. I don't care. What are your thoughts? Like Law said, it's trying to rob that alone, but it's not only you're saying there's your refer, yeah, and to hear she hunt, indeed. Shion and if Rena's Shion's th We don't know anything while the main body uh, Shion, if these thorns really are a part of Rena's great spirit. The question is, suffice it to say, that flower grow 
the wedge, and we only know about Hevrick 35. It wouldn't ask us to. Our minds are made up. Let's go give Hevrek 35 our answer. Do you have your answer? We want to ask some. You're asking us to fight an entire planet. You must have something up your sleeve. Her the great astral spirit is an immense being. Rather, its will is to... Therefore, if you destroy the core, the great spirit shall become unable to maintain sentience. And how are we supposed to destroy that core? By using the Renus Alma. <sighs> you will also need the assistance of both the Sovereign and the Maiden. Using their powers, the Maiden shall seal the great astral spirit within her body, and the Sovereign shall wield the power of the Renis Alma to destroy it. Hold on. That sounds a lot like what Xion described before. Yeah, killing herself to take out the thorns with her. She was actually right all along. By my calculations, your powers combined should be sufficient to... What will happen to the Maiden? One... Any matter contained within the field of destruction shall be erased. So it really will kill me. This method is the most simple one available. What are our other options? There is little reason to consider alternative courses. You don't get it. We didn't fight this whole time just to give up. This plan shall lead to the f- That's- It is vital that you proceed. <sighs> 300 years ago, the Great Spirit descended upon Lenegus in an attempt to assume direct control of the spirit channeling ceremony. We have reason to believe the Great Spirit left part of itself behind. Which would make Alphen's earlier hypothesis correct. That part inside the Maiden belongs to the Core, and can be used by the Great Astral Spirit to revive itself. So long as it remains, that is why- Without the Maiden's do- No! <sighs> Wait. Naori said that the Renis Alma can suppress the self-realization of astral energy. If so... Well? It is true that the Renis Alma is capable of what you suggest. Yes! However, doing so requires fine control on the level of the spirit channeling ceremony. Considering that the Renis Alma was- What does that mean? Your starship will- Why you- Alfin? Whatever we do, if we mess up, Dana's screwed. If you're fine letting that happen, and we have nothing to gain either way, then I'd rather do nothing. We want to stop Dana from getting destroyed. We want to save it. But not if it means having to sacrifice one of us in the process. If all you're gonna do is sit back and watch us where it's safe, Alfin. What, you- You'll agree? I am an observer. I wish to see how- But what are we supposed to do about the Ren- It is likely that the Ren- So our only- According to my- So right in the- I have one more- What will happen to- Without the will of the Great Spirit, Rena is predicted to collapse. So you're saying that even if- Likely, the co- Man! Have Rec 35 and fix our star- Excellent. But I want to make one thing clear. Remember that. It matters- Repair work finished. Man, is it too much to ask for Hever 35 to talk like a normal person? I swear I can feel my brain starting to fry.